welcome to perfect guardian and i'll tell you why is durga called narayani indian mythology is beautifully confounding to people who don't understand the basic principle of unity in diversity the many names ascribed to the same feminine principle of god narayani is one of them why narayani well i was very surprised to learn the reason behind this name because it was so obvious on the one hand and i was so naive as to not realize it on the other the sister of narayana is narayani of course goddess durga not lakshmi the confused of vishnu is called narayani because she is revered as a sister of lord narayana now there is a similar connotation another name given to goddess durga is padmanava sahodatri udar means womb while sahodri means sister and padmanava is the name given to narayana or vishnu this goddess durga represents her sisterhood to lord narayana now the meaning of narayani one of the meaning given for this name is exposer of consciousness it is a beautiful name because the goddess is worshiped as an energy behind this universe who holds the power to expose the consciousness so that unity with the divine can be achieved now there is another meaning another meaning to this name is the one who represents the real nature of the material world once again emphasizing on the primordial power of the feminine form of god there are other meanings as well narayani also denotes the innate power behind ultimate god it also means she who provides the basis for all living things or she who is the power behind lord narayana she who is the power of illusion behind lord narayana she who is the personification of salvation she who is fit to be worshiped by devas now the other reason is devi mahatmyam there are 16 shlokas in devi mahatmyam that are called narayani stuti in which this form of goddess is invoked and worshiped the spect of goddess durga like shiva goddess durga is also ascribed many characteristics however the main theme of all of this is feminine power she represents the energy of god she is the mother she is the mother who gave birth to to this universe she is the one who operates it and she is the one who consumes it in self in herself i mean to say she is adi shakti she is worshiped as the primordial power and is called adya or adi shakti she represents she represents the inner energy of god like kali and chandi the powerful enraged forms of durga are worshiped as kali and chandi where she is represented as the slayer of demons who wreak terror in the universe she is also known as bhagavati she is worshiped as the giver of everything the protector of the feminine aspect and as the doting mother by her devotees she is lakshmi and saraswati at an esoteric level she is one with lakshmi and saraswati and represents the same goddess she is also worshiped as parvati the daughter of mountain and the mother of kartika and ganesha she has thousand of names there are thousand of names given to goddess durga representing various characteristics of her various forms all are significant and have their own meanings now it is which form do you like the most like i personally like the form of goddess durga sitting on the lion or tiger now which form do you cheer is the most do say your thoughts and please give your comments thank you please subscribe to my channel thank you